Hey everyone, in today's Netflix video, I wanted to show you how to create and delete profiles. And it's a great way to separate if you're sharing a single sign-in to create your own profile so all your habits, your viewing history, everything is just on your profile and you could switch between profiles, especially for different family members. Now, I'm gonna show you this on netflix.com on a browser, on a computer. A lot of different apps have this option, a lot of them don't. So the easiest way to show you how this is done is on netflix.com. For example, my Apple TV has this option, but my mobile device doesn't have this option, for example. So I'm gonna jump into netflix.com and sign into my Netflix account here. And now that I'm signed in here, I'm gonna go up here and I'm gonna say manage profile if that automatically doesn't show up for me. So I'm gonna go to manage profile. You might automatically get to this page where you can manage your profile. Now let me show you why you should do this on netflix.com. Let me just show you on a mobile browser what happens here. So here's the same exact page on a mobile browser, but there is no plus option here. Like I said, some apps have it, some don't. So to play it safe, Netflix.com on a computer is your best bet. This is actually Netflix.com on my mobile phone, and for some reason it doesn't have that plus option here, and there is no way to get to it. And here is the Netflix mobile app, and on the mobile app, the add profile option is here and you could delete it. And here, I'll just show you that real quick. I'm on the mobile app here. If I go to the more option on the bottom of the screen, I could say manage profile, exactly what I'm showing you on a computer. But let me finish this up on a computer on netflix.com. So here on that same manage profile tab, you want to press add profile and now you could create a new profile. So let me just go ahead and name this profile and you could actually have the kid option to show you some of the features of the kid Netflix option here. It shows you right there, but I'm just gonna do a regular profile, press continue, and it's been created, and I could always press the pencil to go ahead and edit it. So I could choose a different language here, I could choose a different maturity level, especially if you're for little kids or teens here, I could change that, and I could always delete the profile here. So on any of these options, if you press the pencil icon, you go over here, you could just press delete profile. It's gonna ask you again and you could press delete profile. And as you could see, the profile has gone on back to the four that I started with. Same thing on the mobile app here. If I go to manage profile, I could press add profile here. I could do another test profile, press save on top. And as you could see, I have a test profile, profile number five. I could press the pencil icon again and I could press delete and it will let me delete it just like that back to the four profiles. So depending on how you're doing this on what device, it's gonna be a little bit different, but just about every device is gonna have add profile just like this and delete profile under the pencil icon here, the delete profile option. And I showed you how to do it on netflix.com on a computer and I'm on the iOS app here on my iPhone. It's the same exact way. I hope you found this quick video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for daily tech videos just like this one and I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.